real stack of dirty dishes and he had one vision to get them clean. First to get loaded at this festival was the LG. It looks very nice from the outside and there's a few features that it's got. Like this one here, for instance, it says here, the smart diagnosis. You simply dial customer services, place your phone next to the machine and the tone the dishwasher makes explains the fault. So it's like a dishwasher doctor. Ridiculous. Down here we've got these jets. Now these jets are a new feature. What they do is they shoot out steam onto the dishes. So if you've got like a plate and it's got a bit of dried egg on there, you stick it into the steamer, wallop! It loosens it up and go to bed and have a nice night's sleep without thinking about, oh, I'm going to scrape the egg off in the morning. Perfect. All of our dishwashers were set to the eco cycle, which uses less electricity and water by cleaning at a lower temperature for a longer time. Once the LG was fully loaded, it was <coughs> onto the whirlpool. It looks quite similar to the LG, you know, that sort of brushed metal kind of contemporary sort of look, which is good. It can sense when the water's dirty, it will use a little bit more water. If it's not so dirty, it will hold back on the water, saving more water, being more economically friendly, cheaper for you, good for the polar bears, there you go. And there was still some crusty crockery left over for the Beko. It's got no real, no real flair from the outside. You wouldn't look at it and think, yeah, I like that dishwasher. It's got the little tray up here, see that? For your knives and forks, but you know, if you don't like that, if you're a traditionist like myself, and you like your knives and forks at the bottom, you've got one of these as well. So the fault of everything. It hasn't got all the functions like the diagnostics, the sensors. Like, do you want that with a dishwasher? The LG's eco cycle takes three hours, 45 minutes, the Whirlpool, three hours, 50 minutes, and the Beko, the least, at two hours, 47 minutes. Plenty of time for Joe to catch a few bands. We're going into some music, fellas. Enjoy the festival. I love my job. While the festival goers were getting muddier, Joe's plates were hopefully cleaning up a treat. But would any of them put on a star performance? First up for inspection, the LG. Let's have a little look. Firstly, there's not a great smell coming from it. Plate seems to be clean, it's done a job. I'll definitely give this another wash before I get off of it. Because it just doesn't smell too good. Just cut the smudges, but you know, can't complain. You can see here. Still some spaghetti on the spoon. So for me, the fact that the knives and forks weren't clean, that the glasses were a little bit smudged and it smelled a little bit funky, was disappointing for me. Next on centre stage was the Whirlpool. OK, so let's see how this one's performed. Look at that. Nice and clean. Look, I can even see myself in that spoon. Beautiful. And I do a little sniff test. Look, yeah, that is that don't smell too bad. There's a lot less smudging going on in there. Yep, that's a good clean glass. So I wouldn't say I was surprised with the Whirlpool, but it done a good job. And finally, the Beko. Yeah, this one, it's, it smells fresh. I'll definitely eat my food off one of these plates. Let's have a look, see if it's cleaned them properly. Yeah, the plates and the bowls, they seem to be nice and clean. Let's have a look at the cutlery, okay? Yeah. I mean, for the budget dishwasher, I've got to tell you, this one has performed quite well. I mean, everything seems to be clean. And the glasses, I've got to tell you, the glasses probably look cleaner than any of the other machines. In Joe's eyes, there was only one headline act. The Beko is a bog standard dishwasher, but it does what you want it to do. And that's what you want the dishwasher for, to clean your dishes. Not to talk to you, not to talk to the doctor and say what's wrong with him, not to have jets coming out of it. I just want a dishwasher. That's what the Beko was. 